How's it going, YouTube? And people watching this live on my Twitch channel, twitch.tv slash jjor64. Today is May 5th, 2023. And today we're going to be playing some more Pokemon Stadium on the Nintendo 64 on Nintendo Switch Online. So today we are going to take on the Pika Cup in Stadium Mode. A cup tournament open to the lowest level Pokemon. Strategy is the key here, so... So, um, to my knowledge, Pika Cup and Petite Cup actually don't have four different difficulties like Poke Cup and Prime Cup. So basically you just do eight battles and you win. And the same for Petite Cup as far as I know. So yeah, so we're going to do a Pika Cup tonight. And if we have time, we'll also do a Petite Cup. Okay, I want to start here. I went ahead and registered a team. So this is the team we're going to try. Kadabra, Chansey, Nidoking, Lapras, Raichu, Starmie is what we're going to try out. Let's see how it goes. All right. Bug boy. All right. Um, probably just Kadabra. Uh, Kadabra still gets psychic in this uh, Pika Cup, which is nice. Uh, then probably Nido King, and then maybe Lapras. So for people that have never played Stadium, um, each of the different game modes in this game for the rental Pokemon, uh, the Pokemon actually have different move sets. So like the rental Kadabra in, say, Gym Leader Castle is actually different from the Kadabra here in uh, Pika Cup. All right. Uh, it seems like most of the Kadabras in the game have Psychic, which is amazing. So we're just going to spam Psychic. So Kadabra gets Psychic, but not Alakazam. Alakazam gets Psy... Psy Beam? Psy Wave? One or the other. Oh, it's Butterfree. Butter, butter, Butterfree. Uh, I'm going to Psychic. If you guys didn't know, uh, Psychic is a very strong move in Generation 1. <laughs> Maybe a little too good. That did a whole whopping 2 damage. I guess you guys won't know what I'm gonna do. Psychic. <laughs> Bam. <clears throat> I like it when um, when you uh, pick Pika Cup. Strategy is key. Yeah, my strategy is uh, Spam Psychic. <laughs> Jeez. Ah, uh, it's like a... This is level 16. That's fine, because we're Kadabra. Oh, and we get a crit to rub it in. Let's go. Alright, we'll take that. Let's go! So we are very slowly making progress to unlocking round two in this game. So for people that have never played this game, which there's a lot of people that have never played Stadium. Uh, once you beat all of the Stadium mode, get all the cups, beat Gym Leader Castle. Then I believe you, there's like a, a unlockable Mewtwo fight. And when you beat the Mewtwo, then you unlock round two, which is basically, it's a hard mode. You unlock hard mode in this game. Um, I bet you don't know what I'm going to do. I'm going to click uh, Kadabra and Nido King. And a Lapras. I think that's what we do. The main reason I put Raichu on the team is like just in case we need a fast Thunder user. So in the um, Pika Cup here, all the veil all the Pokemon are actually not available. So in most of the stadium modes, Jinx is actually insanely good, along with Kadabra. But Jinx is actually not legal in this mode. I think the main reason for that is uh, when you tried to catch a Jinx in... This is my guess. I don't know if this is true or not. But if you try to catch Jinx in red and blue, it cannot be this low level. That's just my guess. Um, I'm going to psych it. <clears throat> I also have Metronome, so so Kadabra gets Metronome and Pika Cup, which could be funny. 
Air hit. Taken down with one hit. There's a difference in the number of reserve Pokemon. All right. Oh, it's Bellsprout. Bellsprout. Um, I'm gonna psychic. <laughs> Bam! And we get another critical hit to rub it in. Let's go, gamers. The one hit wonder. And there goes the battle. Perfect. Extra continue. So in stadium mode, if you don't lose any of your Pokemon, you get to continue. We've got battle three. All right, so we got a bunch of water. So here we'll probably end up using Raichu. So it has thunder. Starmie also has thunder. We also got Nido King. Also got Chansey. It has Thunderbolt. So we're probably also. I'm actually just bring Chansey. <laughs> That's actually probably the better pick, right? So I think what we might do is start Kadabra, bring Chansey, and I think we might actually bring Raichu. So that's more special. Starmie has more special, but Raichu gets Stab Thunder. You're also faster, too. Oh, we might just go Starmie. I'm just going to go Starmie. All right. <clears throat> Excuse me. Well, that's the one Pokemon I didn't want to see because you resist. <laughs> I'm so tempted to go Metronome here. Uh, nah, we'll go to Chansey. Metronome would be pretty funny, though. Get, like, Metronome Fissure. That'd be pretty funny. Oh, it's Chansey. Bubble Beam. Oh, my speed fell. Does it really matter? Because Stario is already faster anyways. Uh, I am going to Thunderbolt. Chansey's got a really good moveset. Well... Bubble Beam, Thunderbolt. I have Stab, Try Attack, just in case. Also, I have Counter, too, which is also amazing. Try Attack, it doesn't really matter, but having Counter is pretty nice. Oh, that's one shot. Let's go. Yeah, Chansey's so good in Gen 1. Amazing Pokemon. Amazing. War Tortle. Um, I'm going to Thunderbolt. Tackle. What's that? I didn't know them. Let's go. Like Damn. Try <laughs> counter. Now nah, we'll just Thunderbolt. Is that really your best move is tackle? I guess to be fair, my defense stat is pretty bad. The AI probably thinks that's the best way to deal damage. Is it down and out? Yes, it is, gamer. It is down and out. <laughs> Magikarp, the best Pokemon to ever exist. It's fast for me. Yeah, I remember I did, uh, we did take a speed drop from that bubble beam, but that's right. Boom. All right. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. And there goes the battle. Put my nose. Keep the microphone arm. Try to get this in a good position. <laughs> Eek a cup. That's all four. All right. Uh, I think here we actually go Nido King. 
Surprisingly, Nido King actually gets Earthquake, which is pretty nuts. Look at look at this thing's move pool. Nido King and Earthquake, and this is amazing. Uh, then Lapras, and then probably just Kadabra. Might go Chansey here. I, I think we actually don't go. I think I'm actually go Chansey. Yeah, I think we're gonna do this. No Kadabra this game. For some reason we lose. We do have a million continues, so. That's yeah, really crazy, though, that they gave Nido King Earthquake in this mode in Pika Cup. So we're going to spam Earthquake against this guy. Nido King use Earthquake. Boom! Like Looks like a bad Pokemon choice. It's Sandler. Adam Sandler? What? And then I also get Bubble Beam. Man, Nido King has a really good move pool in this mode. Okay, that's fine. Swift, that's fine. This could do like no damage. Oh, they got a critical hit though. I still didn't even do 20 damage. What a furious battle. This is furious. Neo King versus Sandru. William. That's super effective. Oh, is, it is it down and out? Yes, it is, gamer. It is a down and out. <laughs> Nine lur. Nine lar. Uh, Earthquake. Hit right. You're faster. Okay, hopefully no paralysis. Okay. This doesn't knock out. We still got two more Pokemon in the back, so. Bam. Let's go, Nido King. Easy peasy. And there goes the battle. All right, another continue. All right, halfway there, gamers. Uh, we just bring Nido King, right? Nido King does really good, except maybe Kingler might be a little problematic. And then I think we bring Raichu. No, I uh, Chansey. And then we might bring Kadabra, because I just want something fast. I think we'll bring Kadabra. So start Nido King, Chansey, Kadabra. We're in the last half of the tournament. Things will get quite hot. Nido King! It's Raya Chew. Well, good thing we started Nido King, right? I am going to do uh, the Earthquake attack. Raichu is normally faster. Body Slam, okay. No para. Son of a bitch. They got the para. Okay, we get the Earthquake, though. Their levels are getting higher. They're three levels ahead of me. Spec off my monitor. Well, I think we probably just take the L here, right? Yeah, I think we just take the L on Nido King here. And then we just safely swap in the Chansey, I think. So we'll just take the L here and go for an Earthquake. Yeah, we're probably dead. Yeah. We actually survive. And we get the Earthquake. Okay, we'll take that. Uh, we're not going to knock it out. King Lair's got pretty good defense stat. Yeah, that didn't. I didn't even do half. All right. Well, at least we got an Earthquake off. So that's pretty nice. Bubble Beam. It's super effective. Is it down and out? Yes, it is, gamer. Uh, and we'll do Chansey. We'll spam Thunderbolt. Chansey, 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 Chansey. The Pokemon are entirely 
Thunderbolt. Okay. Okay. Phew. Holy shit. That did a lot of damage. As a Kingler's got a really good attack stat. It's got a very good attack stat. And I have a terrible defense stat. All right. That's a man key. Um. Well, I guess we Thunderbolt. Thunderbolt does more than Bubble Beam. I can also counter. Which I think we might actually go for the counter. I might be dead here. I'm going to go for the counter. Yeah, I think we're dead. Yep. Well, it's a good thing we brought Kadabra, right? <laughs> All right, we got Kadabra, and we'll just do Psychic. Kadabra. All right, psychic. Bam, and we get a crit again. <laughs> we got a lot of crits. All right. And there goes a battle. Do, 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 do. Well. All right, here we go. Next battle, my fellow gamers. What we got? Okay. All right. So now they got some variety here. Okay. I do like Lapras. Starmie is also nice, I think. I think we might actually start Starmie. Probably Chansey. And then Kadabra, I think, just for speed. Starmie, Chansey, Kadabra. The only really scary thing on their end is their Kadabra. So if we can get rid of their Kadabra, we're in there. I just don't want to start Nido King. I really don't hate Nido King either. Maybe we actually do, do Nido King. Let's reselect. Nido King, Chansey, Kadabra, I think is what we're going to do. No Starmie. So they start Kadabra, we might swap. Okay, they don't. Okay, good. All right. What does more damage here? I think Earthquake will still do more. I'm not really sure. I'm just going to Earthquake. Okay. Reflect. That's kind of annoying. But last time we played, we learned that uh, Reflect and uh, Light Screen are really goofy in Generation 1 where... They don't stay active for like they actually survived. Uh, they don't stay active for your entire team. They only stay active for this current Pokemon. That's it. That did a lot of damage. To be fair, that was a stab mega kick. That still did a shitload of damage though. So we'll knock this out, and then the reflect is gone. Okay. Is it down and out? I don't know if I'm faster. So I think I might just stay in and just Earthquake anyways. Shit, all right, we're dead. So we'll probably go Chansey. I thought about swapping in Chansey, but I'd rather just get Chansey in safely. That's nice and healthy. Uh, Chansey. Chansey, Chansey, Chansey. Uh, Thunderbolt. Do you do a normal or... Okay, they just surf, so... It is stab surf. But we do have amazing special. Oh, yeah, that did nothing. 24 damage. All right, we're in there. <laughs> Look at my HP. I have 104 at level 15. They have 45 at level 15. <laughs> Chansey. Chansey's so good. Okay. 
Okay, they actually do have a... Did you just knock yourself out? That did a shitload of damage. They don't, okay. Thunderbolt. All right. Going down. All right, what do you got, gamer? Rhyhorn is not bad to see because I can bubble beam here. We're faster too, which is great. Level 20, but this will still knock it out. Oh, and we get a crit to revenue. We didn't need that crit. Rhyhorn and Rhydon's special stat is very bad. And they're times four weak against water and grass, so. All right, no continue, but that's fine. Do, 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 do. All right, two more gamers. We haven't lost yet, which is nice. Pika Cup semi final. All right, now they're starting to get some hard shit. All really good Pokemon, except Meowth is like the odd duck. Okay. I like Kadabra a lot. Also, like Chansey a lot. And probably Lapras, right? Lapras. Okay. Also, like Nido King. Nido King, Chansey. Lapras. I really want Chansey. Also, I would love to have Nido King as well. If I see Gyarados, I think we swap into Chansey. That's kind of tough. I'm kind of scared of Gyarados. Gyarados is kind of scary. But maybe we just bring Kadabra. I think we would do this. Mr. Mime could also be annoying. Let's try this. We do have four continues, so we do have a little bit of wiggle room. Okay, that should be fine. We should be able to take a hit from Arcanine. Arcanine will be fast. They swap. Is this Gyarados? Oh, you dig a hole. So unfortunately, Earthquake actually doesn't hit this in Gen 1. In later games, this would actually hit. Then Generation 1, it doesn't actually hit. So they're digging. None of my Pokemon can really take a dig. I think we just stay in. I, th I think we survive. Because it's not stab. It is super effective, but it's not stab. Okay. I don't know if this kills, though. I really hope it does. That'd be great. Shit does not. Uh... Well, they probably just dig again, right? Yeah. All right, I think we're just going to sacrifice Nido King for a safe swap. And probably go Kadat. Fuck, who do I go? That's a big question. Because Arcanine, I think, just outspeeds my entire team. So if we do lose this, I think next time we bring Lapras. I'm going to try Kadabra. I'm pretty sure Arcanine will outspeed. Damn, that's tough. Oh, it's Kadabra. It has to make up for lost ground. How will the Titan oh, I have Seismic Toss double team? I could potentially double team here. Let's psychic and see what happens. We are faster. Okay, good. Alright, we're lucky. Okay, we got lucky. We're actually faster. I think normally Arcanine is faster, so. Thankfully, we got lucky there. Yeah, that's the one Pokemon I really didn't want to see here. I do have Seismic Toss. I think 
Psychic is going to do jack squat. Let's see how much Psychic does. I get metronome as well. Fuck it. We're going for it. We're going for the metronome. Give me something good. Poison sting. I did two fucking damage. <laughs> Psychic. All right. This shouldn't do much on me. Okay, we're just gonna go. I think psychic. Okay, let's see how much psychic does. We have seismic toss. So can psychic do at least fifteen damage? Fifteen or more. If I could drop their special, that'd be amazing. That did ten damage. Yeah, okay, yeah. I think we have the seismic toss. Yeah, we're at a seismic toss here. Well, we tried the metronome. Hopefully, we got an amazing move, but sadly, we did not. Okay. Okay. So, at least we should knock it out of here. We'll survive with one HP. The seismic toss does as much damage as your level. So, it will always do 15 damage. So, we just seismic toss here, and that's a guaranteed 15, and that'll knock out Mr. Mime. Is it down and out? There's only one Pokemon left in reserve. Oh, it's here. Uh, well, they actually brought me out, which is hilarious. Uh, do you have quick attack? No. There's the attack. Oh, and we dropped their special. It was pretty nice. Survive with two HP. Bite. Why would you bring me out? All right, we need Chanty to survive a one hit. We're down to one Pokemon aside. Oh, it's Chanty. There's just one Pokemon aside now. The battle is coming right down to the wire. It's <sighs> annoying. Okay, good. So we better get through that. I don't want to lose to double team Meowth. <laughs> that would not be fun. There goes the battle. Bam, 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 bam. All right, one more gamers. And Pika Cup is in the bag. Still got four continues, so. All right, here we got final battle. Okay, we definitely bring Chansey for sure. Probably just Kadabra, Chansey. Starmie, I think. I think we bring Starmie. Yeah. I want, I want speed. And then I can Thunder Slow Bro if we need to. Alright, look at that. Alright, here we go, gamers. The final battle! Raticate. Not too scary. Does Raticate get Slash? That's the big question. If they double edge, they Hyper Fang, okay? I might do decent damage. That just fucking killed me. Oh uh, shit, that's not good. Level 18. Well, that's unfortunate. Uh, well, Starmie should hopefully outspeed. That sucks. Yeah, that's a bummer. Okay. Like I said, good thing we got four continues, right? So what does more damage here? Psy Wave or Bubble Beam? I actually want to look this up. Psy Wave is weird, isn't it? So let's do a little research on Psy Wave. Psy Wave is an odd move. Um, so let's go to Smogon Dex. Search up Starmie. Generation 1. And let's look up the move Psy Wave. Psy Wave. 
skills damage to the target equal to a random number from the from the number one to the user's level rounded down so probably just bubble beam here yeah side wave is a weird move it actually still outspeeds me that's actually not good shit get the speed drop here please damn no speed drop damn this eradicate might just destroy me um fuck it's tough we're speed tying we're actually speed tying give me speed drop so it's an actual speed tie damn this damn so i think hyperfang is 90 accuracy damn well uh chancy all right chancy you versus the world uh, we Thunderbolt. The battle has become one side. Hyper thing. Yes, they missed. Okay. Like I said, I think it's 90 accuracy for Hyper Fang. There, it's a hit. It's down. Ew. Well, we go Thunderbolt. I might have. Let's see what it does. Hyper fucking beam. Oh shit! I wish I countered, man. Oh my god! If I countered here, that would have been amazing. I did nothing. Well, we just lose. Cause it has to recharge this turn. Shit. I was not expecting Hyper Beam there. I'm not going to lie. It can't make a move. What's that? That... Yeah, I was hoping for Para. Well. The but we're dead here. They can miss. Hi... Oh, they just Thunderbolt. Thunderbolt. They get a crit. Damn. Well, that... <laughs> he completely caught me off guard. <clears throat> I kind of want to start Neo King now. Maybe we actually try a Lapras. We might need some bulky Pokemon. And they brought Slowbro. Damn. Okay. Well, like I said, we got all these continues. So let's go. All right, we got a second try. I think Neo King, Lapras, and something else I want. We definitely need. Probably Chansey, right? Nido King, Lapras, Chansey. I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try Nido King. Okay, so they start Raticate again. They do. All right, well we definitely EQ. Is that one an Earthquake or Double Kick? They actually, you have Dig. Why do you have Dig? Let's fucking eradicate it so fast. Um. Alright, let's do a little research. I want to double check on double kick. So let's look at double kick here. Double kick. Hits twice, damage calculated once for the first hit, and use for both hits. Uh. We might. I kind of. Because it's super effective. Let's try double kick here. The trainer hasn't I can't miss. If I miss, it's Gen 1 miss. Super this eradicate us. <laughs> Doing damage. Ah. Oh, I mean, we just got a crit. We, oh, we don't kill it. That's so sad. That's so sad. Ah, that sucks. They bubble beam. So hyper fang, dig, bubble beam, and one other move. Damn, that sucks. We got the crit and we still didn't kill it. Super effective crit lit. Well, I think we just go Lapras now just because it's big and chunky. Oh boy. Oh, it's 
it has to make up for lost ground. Um, well, Ice Beam, for sure. A miss. What now? Damn. Yep. Alright, Ice Beam. Yep. Man, this Raticate <laughs> is messing me up, man. I think Raticate being level 18 here is not helping. Alright, what we got? So last time they did Hyper Beam. The Pokemon are entirely different types. I could growl. That lowers their attack stat, but I think we just go for Ice Beam and hope for a freeze. Uh, Speed Tie, or we just try Freeze? That's not a freeze. They Thunderbolt, okay. Come on, give me the freeze. Give me the freeze. Give me the freeze. Give me the freeze. Damn. Dude, this guy's team is a hard as balls. This is rough. Every time they've started Raticate, maybe I'd just try starting Lapras next turn. They probably just hyper beam here, right? Oh, Ooh, man, this guy's tough. Every every other battle is fairly easy. They do hyper beam. Shit. Yeah, so that's a damage roll. Man, that's rough. I gotta think, who do I have on my team? I don't have a ghost type. We're down to one Pokemon if we don't get it this attempt, we might have to put a ghost type on the team. Oh, they brought the same exact team. Well, the only way I can win is if I Thunderbolt, get a Paralysis, and then I need to get Paras until I knock it out. That's the only way I win. We do have Raichu as well. Damn, I needed the Paralysis. That almost killed it. Damn, that sucks. Damn, that fucking sucks. Man, this is hard. Like, who should I start? I might just try starting Lapras. Damn. I think they're gonna keep bringing. So what do I, okay, we need something for Raticate. I think we might try Lapras here. Clefable's annoying as balls. This is rough. It really is, this is, this is hard. Army is my fastest Pokemon. I'm gonna try this. So we know Raticate outspeeds Kadabra. I really need an electric move for Slowbro. All right, we're gonna try Lapras start. This is it, the final battle. Who will bask in the glory of the championship? Okay, why don't we go Ice Beam? Come on, give me the freeze, give me the freeze. Okay. What a furious battle. Man, this, this is hard. This is rough. What now? They miss. Okay, good. So that means if Clefable comes in next, we should. I think we could take at least a one. Thunderbolt. They're, they're probably gonna go Thunderbolt here, so. Come on, give me the freeze. Give me the freeze. Freeze, freeze, freeze. 
What is the ice beam freeze chance in Gen 1? Probably 10. Oh. Uh, yeah, the Thunderbolt. I think we should survive the hit, as long as it's not a critical hit. Okay, let's look. Ice beam. 10% freeze. Okay. So that hasn't changed over the years. Well, we just ice beam here. It's my strongest move. Oh, we get a crit. Oh my God. We, we have a chance now. We just need to beat this damn slow, bro. There's a difference in the number of reserve Pokemon. Okay, so they just brought the same exact team again. Okay, we know what we're faster. The thing is, I can't really do any damage. The battle has become one sided. And what do I have in the back? A weird part of me wants to growl this turn just to lower their attack stack. Because we actually really don't know that it's moves. I think I'm actually going to go for the growl. We're going to do no damage, but we're going to lower their attack stat. And then they psychic. Just in case for some reason they have a physical move. Like Starmie. Alright. So I... I guess we probably just go Nido King here, right? And just get an Earthquake. And then Starmie. We're gonna have to go Thunder. Alright, so we got a Growl. They probably psychic and probably kill me. Slowbro is insanely good in this game. So what other moves do I have? Double kick, we have nothing. So we, we need an earthquake. If I get a critical hit here, that'd be amazing. What now? Oh my god, we got a critical hit. Didn't kill though. Yeah, we're dead. This is probably gonna kill us. No way we're surviving this. No way. We actually survived that. Wow, that is amazing. But that crit did a little over half, so this won't knock out if it's not a crit. Yeah, it barely stays alive. Okay. We definitely needed that critical hit. That's for sure. We needed that. Is it down and out? Both combatants are down to their last Pokemon gamers. Okay, here's the weird thing. I really don't want to go Thunder here. Embed it on a 70 here. I think we actually legit just go Bubble Beam here. Because we only need to do 7 damage. They resist water, but this is Stab Bubble Beam from a Starmie. This has to do at least 7 damage, right? Okay, I was going to say, you better at least do seven damage. All right, we did it, gamers. That is Pika Cup. Let's go. All right. We did it, gamers. Pika Cup is now completed. Oof, that was rough. <laughs> that damn Raticate being so fast, and then that Clefable having stab hyper me. <laughs> oh my goodness. So we didn't even use Raichu once, did we? So I probably didn't need Raichu. Pika Cup clear. Let's go, GG. Yep, so there's only one cup. Yep. Let's go here. All right, well, I think we're actually going to take on Petite Cup. So what I'm going to do now is off air. I'm going to look at the team and we'll create a team. And then we'll use that for a Petite Cup and go from there. So let's take a look at the rentals and let's make a team. All right, we are back and we created a team. So this is the team I thought we we're going to try out. Spiro, Krabby, Psyduck, Geodude, Cubone, and Horsey is what we're going to try out. So looking through all the rental Pokemon for this mode, uh, some Pokemon are actually banned. 
even in even at their single stage like onyx is banned staryu's banned chancy there's actually a handful of pokemon they're actually banned oh we got spiro here uh horsey Just because that has Ice Beam. I just noticed uh, my team is pretty weak against Grass, and that was actually by accident. <laughs> I actually didn't mean to do that. All right, well, we definitely got to watch out for Grass types then. A Mega Punch here. Maybe we might go Psyduck. I just noticed that when I was making the team. <laughs> well, we're going to go Spiro, though. Horsey, a Psyduck in the bag. All right. That's funny. All right, here we go. Petite Cup now. Caterpie. So we are just going to do uh, Fly. So I get uh, Stab Fly and Stab Double Edge for Spiro. So I was like, that sounds pretty good. And Sparrow is stronger than um, Pidgey, so that's why we're doing Sparrow. Yeah, so for Petite Cup is only uh, unevolved Pokemon only. And then like I was saying earlier, some unevolved Pokemon are actually still banned. Bam. Super effective. So most of the time with Sparrow, we'll probably just keep doing Fly. That's probably what we'll do. It's execute. How will the type difference affect that? It blew up again. All right. Hypnosis. Ooh, that could be annoying. Watch out for that. But it failed. What a furious battle. Sparrow, use fly. Super effective. Damn. Okay, 60 accuracy. Missed. I think here in this situation, we double edge. Because Fly can actually miss. Fly, I believe, is 90 accuracy. All right, we double edge here. Double edge. Is it down and out? Yep. And <laughs> Weedle. All right, well, thankfully we got lucky and they didn't pick like all their grass types. They only picked one. All right, we fly. Well, that's why I forgot. So that's a goofy Gen 1 mechanic is if you use a recoil move and you actually get a knockout, you don't take the recoil. I always forget about that. Gen 1 has so many goofy mechanics. I should say uh, a lot of unintentional mechanics. I'm pretty sure most of the weird goofiness in this game was fixed in Gen 2, Gold and Silver. Now there's one down. Perfect. Boulder by Edge. All right, here we go. They got Ditto. Horsey, Spiro. We'll probably be bringing a lot of Spiro. Krabby? I don't hate bringing Krabby. Krabby is fairly fast and also has pretty good uh, attack. Okay, so who's faster? Psy I also bring Psyduck. Psyduck is faster. Horsey's pretty fast, too. Maybe Geodude. I think we'll actually bring Geodude. Geodude. I would do it, Geodude. What kind of can we All right, let's we'll start Horsey. Hey, bring Ditto. Okay, well, well we're going to be faster here. So we probably just... We can freeze here. I think we just go for the bubble beam, just hopefully get a speed drop. 
Also with stab, I guess it would be exactly the same power, right? Speed drop would be nice. We don't get it. I did a lot of damage, though. Now they transform. How much is... I'm, I'm going to try Swift. I'm kind of curious. Okay, we... Oh, let's speed tie. Makes sense. Why speed ties? Okay. Let's see how much this does. That did 10 damage. Oh, okay. Well, we got a crit there, so we'll take that. Okay. We just swift again then. Let me go first. We lose speed. Oh, and of course a smoke screen, right? Of course they do. <laughs> Son of a gun. Well, swift never misses. We might swap out because that accuracy drop could bite me in the ass. We got a double crit. Okay, and it's Ekans. I think we might just swap out into Geodude. Uh, Geodude. Geodude. <clears throat> All right, let's go Geodude. Yeah. Ugh, glare, that's a little annoying. Okay. Well... I just gotta dig. Fight. Four damage. Damn. I can't remember if I uh, if I do dig even on second turn of dig if it does a paralysis check again. I don't remember. Oh fuck, you have a wrap. That's annoying. Well, we did find out that if we get wrapped, we can actually swap out, break out a wrap, and that just takes the entire turn up. Guess we just go horsey here and I'm just gonna bubble beam. The Pokemon returns to its Pokeball. Hey, I need you to get a critical hit. Speed drop two. At least a critical hit would be nice. That did a lot of damage. Damn it, I need to declare again. Oh, they miss! Let's go! Can Glare miss? Or is that a Gen 1 miss? I think that was a Gen 1 miss. I think Glare's 100% accuracy, isn't it? No. 75. They eventually buffed Glare. So in Generation 1, Glare could actually miss. Okay, that's actually good to know. Cool, we got lucky there. Bad assay. Uh, we ice beam. The battle has become one sided. Oh, oh, we get the freeze. Let's go. We get the freeze. Well, that's GG. Uh, frozen stage, frozen stat in this game is absolutely broken. <laughs> The only way you can unfreeze from uh, Frozen State and Gen 1 is being hit by a fire move. That's it. That is the only way you can get unthawed. So if you get frozen, it's game over. That's why Blizzard in this game is amazing. It has high freeze chance. Also, it's 90 accuracy in Gen 1. Freeze is just amazing. All right, sweet. We got a checkpoint. All right, I continue. All right, we got lucky there. All right, let's go. Cup Battle 3. Yep. They have Voltorb. So we definitely should bring uh, one of my ground types. We'll probably bring Cubone, right? Um, what do we want here? Hmm. I think I might start horsey. I'm going to bring Cubone. And I think Spiro. The upcoming battle looks promising. We're 
All right, what do we got here? Okay. I think we just stay in and we bubble beam. You use explosion. I'm dead. Well, I don't know. Just say, Gasly's attack stats not great. Okay, well, that helps me a lot. All right, we'll take the W there. Yeah, we swap directly into Cubone. That thing will probably outspeed me. I'm going to go directly into Cubone. Here's a Pokemon chain. Just Sonic Boom. What now? A decent hit. Yep. Well, we Bone Club. Uh, Bone Club. Also a Fire Blast, which is funny. Fuck, you have Explosion too? Jeez, I did nothing. Okay, this must just be Exploding Team then. There's a difference in the number of reserve Pokemon. Okay, yeah, this this gets explosion as well, so I guess just team explosion. All right, well we bone club, we're faster. So. Bam! Please explode. Oh, they can't. That's right. So in, in stadium, there is a uh, there is a clause where your final Pokemon can't explode. That's right. So they can't. But it is exploding team though, because Geodude can learn explosion. All right, let's go. All right, and we get uh, continue as well. Sweet. And there goes the battle. All right, perfect. All right, cool. We gotta continue. All right, that's three down, five to go. That stupid explosion team. I always forget Gasly and them can learn explosion. All right. I don't have any electric attackers. <laughs> well, we, I think S Krabby starts Spiro. And then horsey or side duck. The side duck gets mega punch. And side duck's attack stats actually higher. And also have submission. I might actually go side duck here. I'm gonna go side duck. Yeah, I should probably put an electric attacker on this team, but I didn't. Or no grass. Look at this. My choppy. Uh, should I have a sword stance? Who's faster? I think Krabby's faster. I'm actually going to sword stance. Because Krabby has a good attack stat. Yeah, we should tank this. As long as it's not a crit, right? That a jack squat. Okay, uh, we're going to strength. Let's go, Krabby. Yeah! Damn, that didn't kill. Well, this did 10 damage last time. They got a crit, though. Damn. Neither one is an and then I have stab serve if I need it to. Yeah, Krabby actually has a pretty good move pool for a petite cup. And then I have worst case scenario guillotine as well if I need it. But I think guillotine in Gen 1, if their level is like above me, it just doesn't work, period. Well, there's Krabby. Uh, strength. I don't think we knock it out, though, but we should get some good damage, though. 
strength. So we did get the source dance. You guillotine. They are higher level. Holy shit. They actually went for the guillotine. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm surprised we're actually faster than their Krabby. We're one level lower. Oh my god. They went for the guillotine. <laughs> that was scary. <laughs> oh my gosh. That was scary. All right. Spiro, well, you're faster. Man. Excuse me. Uh, well, we probably just strength, right? Because we're plus two. We should survive that, right? Are you serious? They got the five hits. Uh, we dead. Wow, we actually survive. Lucky SOB. They got the five. All right. Plus two strength. Yes. All right. We get another continue. Let's go, Krabby. Let's go. Oh, Krabby. <laughs> That's what Krabby sounds like in the anime. Yo, let's go. We had a very similar team, which is hilarious. All right. Another continue. Teacup. Battle five. Hor okay, Psyduck. Uh, I think we start Horsey. I think I want Spiro. So something faster than Abra. I think we go Krabby again. We also go Geodude. I don't hate either. I think we're gonna actually go Geodude. Mainly, I want the rock typing. Would be nice for three of their Pokemon. Let's try Geodude. 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 Alright, let's go Horsey. Meowth, that's right. Look at this ugly green Meowth. We're gonna bubble beam. Uh, we should survive. I think we swap into Geodude. We're gonna bubble beam here and I'm gonna swap. Critical hit, critical hit. Damn. Uh, we swap. Uh, Geodude. Here's a Pokemon change. Geodude. Geodude. Geo dude. <laughs> All right, let's go. Hey, thanks for watching, everybody. This game is fun. All right, so what do I want to do? Probably not dig, right? Because they had Spiro, right? But we might as well go for the dig. That's my strongest move. I don't know if Rock Throw. I'm just gonna go dig. Oh, yeah, bubbling. Fuck, that kills me, right? Shit, oh my god, good thing we would dig then, right? <laughs> Gotta love the animation, right? Please don't swap. They screech. Alright, don't miss. Okay, I think dig... Uh, is 95 accuracy? So I'm pretty sure Dig can miss. Yeah, oh no, Dig is 100. Never mind. I thought Dig can miss. Nope. Oh, also Dig is 100 base power in Gen 1. What the fuck? Okay, so Dig is 100 base power in this game. They nerfed it in Gen 2. And then Gen 4, they rebuffed it. So in Gen 2 and 3, it's 60 base power. And then Gen 4, they buffed it back to 80 base power. I did not know that. Wow. So digging this game is actually amazing. Uh, I think we just sacrificed Geodude here. Uh, for some odd reason, we get a self-destruct off. We're going to self-destruct. But yeah, I think we just sacrifice. Yeah, we're dead. All right. We're going to go Spiro. I think. Right. Yeah. Oh, 
I really should have brought an electric attacker on my team. But I didn't. Well, uh, we're gonna fly. I should be faster here. You're, oh, you have ice beam too? Shit. I shouldn't kill. Well, that's very bad. You're actually faster. Oh, that sucks. This, we might lose here. We might have to use a continue. Hypnosis. Yeah, it's just straight up faster. I need a critical hit here. I did good damage, but they're just gonna ice beam again, right? I think in this situation here, we actually go double edge because they're faster than me anyways. Yeah, we're dead. Damn. Okay. Uh, in a weird way, their entire team has a bunch of water attacks. So I think this next uh, next time we fight, we definitely bring uh, Krabby. We go the Krabby play for sure. Uh, well, I have to Swift. They have Body Slam too. Damn, that thing has a good move pool. Didn't kill though. I wonder if I maybe should want smoke screen, but do a million damage. That's not a million damage. Come on, give me a million damage. All right. Uh, well, we got Swift again. Damn, this is a fast polywag. We survive. We need whatever's in the back to be quad weak against one of my moves. And I need to be faster. Damn, okay, we definitely bring Krabby. If we lose, which we probably will. Do we pull a miracle off and win here? Well, I think you're going to be faster than me, right? I have to go for an ice beam freeze. And they're faster anyways. Okay, I was going to say, you're probably faster than me. Damn, okay. Damn. We definitely go Krabby. We gotta go Krabby. I still think we... Instead of Geodude, I should bring uh, Cubone. Like, I didn't hate what I picked there. But we definitely want Krabby. Because they could potentially start me out again and have Thunderbolt, right? Psyduck could also be nice. That was more defense. Oh, Hor Horsey just straight out has like way better stats. The only thing Horsey does have has the better attack, but other than that, Horsey just straight better than. I kind of want to start Horsey again. I think we bring Cubone. And then we bring Krabby. So if I see Meowth right away, we swap into Cubone. Because I'm going to assume they probably just picked the same team, right? They don't. Well, do you have an electric move? I think I'm just going to stay in and we're just going to bubble beam. Speed drop would be amazing. Okay. So what do you do? Psychic. Okay. At least that's not stab. Fuck. Well, you dropped my special, though. I kind of got to swap then, right? Oh, that sucks ass. That's the worst time to get that. I got an ice, ice beam here. Do I want to? That sucks. I might swap out. That special drop is horrible. I think I go Cubone. Damn, that sucks. Unlucky. Psychic has like a 30% chance to drop special. Like, Psychic is just an absolutely broken move in Gen 1. Psychic. On the move. 
Okay. Thankfully, that's doing a 33% chance. Yeah, Psychic is so good in this game, in Gen 1. Uh, we definitely Bone Club. You swap. Please be weak against ground. You are not weak against ground. Well, at least we got a Bone Club, though. I don't, don't fucking miss. That did... Uh, damn, so this must be a damage roll, right? They're gonna hit me with a water something something move. Should I swap into horsey now? That thing's gonna be faster than me, right? Or should I? I think we just take the L. I think I'm gonna take. I want to save swap. I'm gonna take the L. Shit. Yeah. Okay. I go Krabby here. Which actually might be better in strength. I'm gonna go Krabby. So we resist, because that's Ice Beam too, right? So we resist both of those moves. I think we just strength. I don't think we sword stance. I don't know what other moves this thing has. I'm just going to go straight strength. That's right, body slam. What's this? Critical hit. Are you serious? I did like no damage though. So I could actually source dance. Right. Heavy damage. I just killed it. Let's go. Oh, All right. So we got Jigglypuff in the back and one more. Which Pokemon is coming out? Which Pokemon is coming out, gamers? I don't know if I'm faster. Uh, well, we have to try and strength. I think we're dead. The psychic. Oh, you substitute. Okay, that's fine. Good thing we just did freaking strength. All right. I hope the AI is dumb and it just keeps going for a substitute. That'd be best case scenario here. Yes, I think the AI is dumb right now. Sweet. All right, that's helping me a ton right now. Okay, that's fine. We'll take it. What a furious battle. Yes, they has been stupid right now. Let's go. There it goes. The substitute disappeared. Neither one is conceding an inch. It's Psy Wave. Okay, good. It's not psychic. That's perfectly fine. Okay, we got fucking lucky. So side wave is like random damage. We kind of got a bad damage roll there, but now we just have Jigglypuff in the back. We just strength. All right. At least we got this guy second try. All right. I think you survived, but like I said, we have one more Pokemon in the back, so we're fine. So we just strength. Okay, that's fine. Because then we have Horsey, which also will be faster. All right, woof, all right. Uh, jig, Jig. You gotta love the dumb nicknames, right? All right, Horsey, all right. All right, we got lucky. Down to the last Pokemon. All right, and we bubble beam. Bam! All right, ooh, that was tough. That was only battle at number five. That was pretty tough. And there goes the battle. Do 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 do. Winner! All right, three more. Three continues. All right, battle six. Okay. Okay, now they got more variety. I don't hate Geodude. Geodude actually does it really good here. Geodude can hit four of them for super effective. Do I actually start it, though? I think I will. I need something that resists, so we probably bring Horsey. 
Horsey's also very good here. As long as we can outspeed Magnemite. And then... Cubone? Like, I, I just need to get rid of Squirtle, right? And we do all right. I think we're going to try this. Like, as long as we can get rid of Squirtle, I think we're in there. I just don't want a Diglett start. That's the one Pokemon I don't want to see. Diglett or Squirtle. Fuck. Well, that's like the one Pokemon I did not want to see. Do I dig myself? Yes. Do they Earthquake? They just scratch. That's fine. Alright, I'm... Uh, Digging down below. They're both being okay, maybe this thing has like no good moves. But then they probably dig too. Oh, they just swap. Is this Zubat? Or fetched. Oh, lucky. Well, that's fine because now we just rock throw. Okay, well, we're lucky that the Diglett's kind of stupid. <laughs> All right, uh, now we rock throw. Sand attack. Fuck. Well, that stinks, but we definitely don't swap. I think we we gotta stay in. I think. Rock throw. Shit. They just leer. Okay, I might have to swap Geo dude out. Come on, rock throw. Okay, we got it. I think Rock Throw is 100% accuracy. I'm gonna look. I'm pretty sure it is. Rock Throw. Rock Throw is only 65 accuracy? What the hell? It made it 90% accuracy in Gen 2. I did not know that. Well, that's terrible. Uh, We probably strengthen. I did not know that accuracy is that bad on that move. Well, at least we resist. They got the they got four. We are minus defense, but we do resist. That did nothing. I didn't know rock throw was that bad. Is there really like any good rock moves in Gen 1? <laughs> I don't think there really is. A lot of rock moves aren't even in this game. Uh generation one. Rock slide and rock throw. That's it. So Rock Slide is definitely the best rock move. It's still the same. 75 base power, 90 accuracy. And that's it. There's only two rock moves. Rock Slide and Rock Throw. That's hilarious. All right, we got rid of the dumb far fetched, so that's pretty funny. All right, Diglett's back. I kind of want to swap out now just because we have the lower accuracy. I think we swap into Cubone. So I really would like to have Horsey, like a safe swap. It's Cubone. Growl. That's annoying, but you really haven't shown any strong moves. You showed Scratch and you showed Growl so far. And that's all you've shown. I could Fire Blast, which would be funny. Uh, let's just Bone Club and just see how much it does. Okay, they dig. Uh, I'm gonna fire blast. Okay. So they actually do have dig. That did really good damage. Well, that definitely is my strongest hitting move right now because we're a minus one attack. They just growl again. Okay, that's fine. Dig, growl, scratch, and something else. All right, let's go. Fire Blast Cubone. <laughs> Come in the clutch. All right. So we don't know who the last one is yet. What do we got? Oh, wait. Oh, fuck. Sorry, guys. Oh, shit. Hold on. 
Uh, one second. Uh, I gotta make sure I actually didn't uh, make myself really loud. I did not. Okay, for a second I thought I accidentally turned up my gain on my microphone. No. <laughs> might be, might be. Hit, hit the bone club. Let's go. Dang. I was hoping that was going to do a little more damage. I guess we could swap into Geodude. So let's swap in the Geodude here. Okay. Flash. Okay. Sorry about that for the no signal. I'm swapping some stuff on my end. Okay. All right, we're good. We're good. Okay. Um. Well, that's a little annoying. Minus accuracy. Well, we definitely dig. This guy's gonna do nothing. I think Geo dude just hard walls this. The Sonic Boom ignore. Uh, the rock. Oh, it just does twenty damage. Oh, okay, I was thinking. Fuck, we missed. Maybe I'm thinking of a different move. Yeah, I think I'm thinking of a different move. And they tackle. Okay. All right, I just need to land a damn dig. And we're in there. But we're minus one accuracy, which is a little annoying. I'm glad I brought both of my ground types against the Magnemite here. Fuck. Alright, we're going Cubone. Stop missing, butthole. That's annoying. One accuracy drop. We missed two digs. It's only one drop, but we still missed both. Okay, he's just Sonic Boom. So this does 20 damage. We need, we want them to tackle, I think. Don't club. We don't want Flash. Okay, good. Don't crit. Okay, that did nothing. Can Bone Club miss? We do hit. Uh, I should probably learn how to spell, right? Bone Club. Yes, Bone Club is 85 accuracy, so it can actually miss. Also has a chance of flinching. I did not know that. 10% chance to flinch with Bone Club. Oh. All right, we got to continue, which is, which is what I really wanted there. I really wanted to continue, which we got it. So I'm happy there. Semi-finals. All right, what we got? Okay. Uh, definitely bring Horsey. We definitely bring probably Cubone. Hmm, what else? Krabby? I don't hate Krabby. They would do that. Horsey, Krabby, Cubone. I could potentially bring Geodude. For Rock. Actually, it might actually be better over Cubone. I'm going to do that. Horsey, Krabby, Geodude. If I see Pikachu, we swap into Geodude. Like, having the Rock typing would be pretty nice. There right, we go. Semifinals. Okay. Thankfully, you're part rock, so we can bubble beam here. Rock and water. You're faster. Critical fucking hit. Are you serious? That sucks buttholes. I just noticed they're also level 30. Uh, that sucks. Well, I guess we go crabby, right? Fuck. That sucks. Or can I go Geodude and potentially tank a hit? Fuck. Good thing we just got that continue, right? It's level 30. Well, all I can really do here is surf. Because they resist strength. What? That's fine. My special's not great, but at least it's stab surf. 
We get a critical hit to rub it in. All right, good. All right, we got surf again. Did 40 damage. You have surf. We resist. My special isn't great, but at least we do resist. Jesus. This thing being five levels ahead sucks. Shit. Damn. This is, might be a damage roll. Yeah, oh my god. This okay, what do we start next turn? I, I still like we start horse. We just got unlucky with that crit. Well, it's not over yet. A fairy. Well. Well, we go strength. I was going to say we could potentially go guillotine. Like, we just go strength. Okay, we get a critical hit. That's amazing. Body slam. Okay. Oh, man. Okay. All right, time to start spamming dig. Oh, my God. Stupid critical hit. Geo, dude. All right, well, we're probably gonna be slower, but we go, we go dig. Minimize, are you fucking serious? That's really bad, because now they could potentially minimize again. Shit. Oh no. Shit. They minimize again, are you serious? Oh my freaking God, please don't miss. Oh my God, thank God we got through that. Oh my God, F this thing, holy crap. Oh my God, stupid Clefairy. Get out of here. Dude, this team is full of trolls, dude. They brought bull picks, all right. We dig. All right, we're definitely slower. A dig battle. I go second, so I get a hit. Okay, we're having a digging battle. All right, let's get. <laughs> All right. All right. What <laughs> now? Ah, hopefully he's dead. Dig is so good. Yes. All right, we came back. We didn't lose. That critical hit double edge definitely scared me. All right, so we're on the final battle of Petit Cup. Let's go. So after I finish Petit Cup, all I have left is to do Gym Leader Castle. And then we can unlock round two. Well, like the Mewtwo fight. I think you do the Mewtwo fight, don't you? Okay, this should be easy. We definitely... We bring Geodude, right? Geodude does really good here. Or we just want ground, right? Horsey also. Horsey actually does it really good here as well. Horsey. I might bring Q-Bone. Just because it's faster than Geodude. Yeah. It's still not very fast. And then Krabby? Like, I want something for Nita, the Nita Rans. I also fly. Krabby has 68 attack. That's really good. I think we bring Krabby, right? I think I want to bring Krabby. Or see Cubone Krabby. Sida could be annoying. Also, Almastar could be annoying. Also, their Almastar is level 30, and their Dratini is level 30 as well. So, we have to watch out for that. I'm going to try this. This is it, the final battle. Who will bat in the glory of the championship? Okay. So, we Bubble Beam. They don't have ground typing yet. They're only poison. So, we just Bubble Beam here. 
I get a speed drop, that'd be cool. Critical hit also would be amazing. That didn't do as much as I thought it would. Toxic, that's a little annoying, but... Okay. Give me a critical hit, come on, critical hit. Damn, so I wonder if that was a damage roll. Okay. What do you do? A tail whip. That's a little annoying, but at least we're not taking damage. And I think with Gen 1 mechanics here, we're going to get the knockout here, and then I won't take poison damage. Okay, that's a first easy Pokemon. Yeah, so we won't take damage. Those are down and out. Next Pokemon B. Okay, there's Omanyte. All right, you have pretty good special, if I remember right. Okay, keep in mind, it's also level 30. Do we outspeed? We do outspeed. So this is level 30, so this definitely won't knock out. That did fucking nothing. Nice surf. At least we resist. I did a lot of damage. Well, we really can't swap here, can we? Um, I think we go for a smoke screen. Our speed. I probably go try and just speed drop, right? I just got bubble beam again. Try to get the speed drop. Critical hit and speed drop. That's amazing. Because now we got Cubone. Double edge. Okay. All right. Can't miss Bone Club. All right. Uh, Cubone. It's Cubone. All right. We're, we should be faster now. Bone Club can miss, so... 85 accuracy, I believe, is what it was. Okay, good. All right, cool. We're only Pokemon left. All right, here we go. Dratini was also... They just bring Santru. That's very good. Who, who did I bring in the back? I brought Krabby. That's fine. Okay, sweet. Uh, I think we just Bone Club, right? Am I faster? I might be. You have Earthquake. That's kind of scary. I didn't do much damage, though. We're in there. I didn't do much, either. Uh... Let's do a little homework. What is Santru? What's your special step? Uh, 30. Uh, we actually fire blast. I think legit fire blast actually is going to do more damage than bone club here. Santru has 85 defense. That's actually pretty good. Especially for like a little cup, petite cup. That's really good. Yeah, let's go. Um, we're probably going to be dead here. This is faster than me. And then we just surf and I think we win. So we should be able to take a, a um, earthquake. So what's Krabby's defense stat? Krabby's defense stat is 90. That's very, very good. Dude, Krabby's stats for this is insane. The fudge? Krabby has 105 base attack. For a stage one evolution, that is insanely good. And 90 defense, that is also insanely good. Oh, we just surf. We're actually faster. Let's go. Eat it. Um, my special attack is terrible. But we're also l lucky that Sandry's special defense is terrible. The 
Let's go, GG gamers. We did it. So we only lost one time, right? I think we only lost once. If I remember it. Let's go, horsey. Uh, definitely, uh, horsey and crabby are very good. I should have probably brought an electric type. Also, Spiro is good. We didn't even use Psyduck, so maybe drop Psyduck for an electric type. Other than that, I actually didn't hate this team. Oops, sorry. I didn't hate this team. Petite cup cleared. All right. Let's go. So that is stadium mode all done. We have all the cups now. All four for each of these. And we got the one here and then the one here. So I believe a gym leader castle is all I have left. And then let's double check. So if I remember right, once you do all of gym leader castle and do all of stadium, then you do like a Mewtwo fight. Right? Yeah, Mewtwo will appear, and then once you beat Mewtwo, then get round two, so. All right, well, this is really cool, because I've never, ever done this before in the past. I actually tried to unlock round two. All right, well, that's it. We just got Gym Leader Castle, and we're going to save that for another time, because we are going to call it there for the night. Let's back out to the menu. And the sick ass title screen. But yeah, that's gonna do for me though. So GG's everybody. We did it. We did it. Um yeah, those cups are not too hard. Definitely the other cups are a lot harder, especially when you do Master Ball tier. So Alright, yep, we just have Gym Leader Castle, and that's it. Mewtwo fight. And I guess we'll save that for the next time we play. Because going all trying to do all Gym Leader Castle in one go will definitely take a little bit of time, so. So I'll have to save that for another day where I have a lot of free time, so that's gonna do for me everybody thanks for watching if you're new to the channel and if you'd like on youtube like comment and subscribe it really helps the channel a lot and i would greatly appreciate it you can also follow the twitch channel and on both of them you can turn on notifications so you know when i'm live on twitch or new videos are out on youtube but that's gonna do for me everybody thanks for watching have a great day take it easy and i'll catch you next time have a good one.